Raymond now have a uh, exhibitions in Central and these exhibitions will be displayed in London to, from tomorrow. Okay, thank you. Uh, well, uh, I'm Raymond and I think most of you know me as an architect for many years, but they didn't know me that actually I started as an artist, but of course an amateur artist, you know, at my secondary school. And of course, after the very long years as architectural practice, then I come to a stage of really, you know, going onto another another track. Now I become a full-time painter, a full-time painter in Chinese ink painting. And why I love Chinese ink painting is because when I was very young, I started to, you know, find a lot of interest in Chinese history and in Chinese culture. And I think therefore build, building up a very strong momentum that one day I wanted to be really as a professional artist and, and now this is the time after here I this gallery will have another space in London which is at the St. James Square having the same name is you know 38112 and they offer me such a good opportunity I think this is really great for Hong Kong artists who can go abroad and bring across Chinese culture into their platforms Here is a gallery which is showing my work uh, under three main you know, subjects. Uh, first of all is breathing, second is life series, and also 18 shapes. And why having such a title is because I think as architect as well as you know, anybody on earth is now understanding you know, the threat you know, upon the, our, our earth is because of all these pollutions and all this danger is actually now attacking us. So, am I going to show something? Now, in terms of painting in here, is having breathing series and life series, which is about our life and plants. And 18 shades is about our mindset of how we see the world. Now, first of all, because as, as an architect, we know we are all under threat universally uh, from our sea, our water pollution, our air pollution, as well as, uh, you know, forest on fire, and even our sky. And we noted that we have to really do something as, as an artist. I think we have to draw the attention to viewers and how I'm going to present in here is by de developing a new technique in which I use some plastic to cover the pigments and the ink and let it evaporate for 24 hours and after that all these colors and pigments they will start to you know becoming textures and after unveil or remove this plastic all these te textures become a very strong uh, uh, quality or kind of a visual quality of the whole piece of painting and this painting I name it our land, which you can perceive it as somewhere in this world, but not particularly any country. However, I think the attention is on to how you read all these details, how these textures go into a very big stretch of, you know, black and color as a combination. And the size of it is 7.2 meter, and it will be presented in Hong Kong again after here. I will not bring this to London because I will have my retrospect exhibition next year. And I think for every viewers here, you will have a chance to see it publicly in uh, my exhibition in Guangdong. Oh, this sort of painting is having a title, 18 Shades in Aim. First of all, 18 is not just the number of paintings, it can be more. But in fact, it is a meaning of when a person looking through windows into the outside world. Of course, you see mountains. And I think whether you see the mountains as something very joyful or very sad, very positive or very negative, it all boils down to your own mindset or your peace of mind. So in here, it's another way of presenting architecture by looking at the very narrow strip which is a window 
And for here, you can tell, being an architect and also a painter, how he interplays two into one over here. On my left here is another briefing series on number 23. Uh, this is also a very important feature piece for this exhibition this time. Uh, what you just see is, I just mentioned about when the earth is under threat and the same as when I apply even the ink and the pigment are under threat. And therefore, when you can see all these details, it's actually a process that I develop. And after, you know, 24 hours, when I take away the piece of plastic, then you can see all these veins, all these textures that actually came from that, te uh, that technique. So this is the set of three, and it's the feature piece for this exhibition this time. However, when I'm talking about breathing, which more related to human beings and animals. At the same time, I also concern what about our plants on Earth? Our plants is also under threat. So in here you can see they are kind of like plants, but not necessarily kind of flowers, which I don't want to mention it. I think I only want to give a very generic ideas of what plants are also under threat because of pollutions in the world. And Therefore, in here, with my paintings, I like to express that we have to really concern our Earth, our universe is under danger because of pollution, which is now attacking us.